The first thing that strikes you about this great Monet water lilies is its sheer scale. It's two meters across and it's incredibly impressive to stand in front of, with the lilies and the high grass giving an extra drama to the composition. Monet painted it in that period of 1914 to 1917 when he was conceiving his great final project, the Grande Decoration, now in the Orangerie Museum in Paris. And Monet's aim was to create a huge room entirely composed of views of his water lily pond. That water lily pond is, of course, one of the most famous images in the history of art. Monet created it in his garden at Giverny, which he bought in 1890, and it became really his favorite subject matter in the marvelous last years of his life. With his command of color and light and his focus simply on the surface of the water, he gets very close to inventing abstract art. And in this sense, is extraordinarily forward-looking. You could imagine this particular painting in the context of a great collection of contemporary art alongside major works of abstract expressionism.